What's up, FF Vibes TV gang? How you guys doing? Welcome down to FF Vibes TV. Welcome down to another upload of another update. Boy, today is Tuesday. We want to say bless Tuesday to you guys and hope you have a fantastic Tuesday. In our upload today, people, definitely we have Pretty Dan coming out and clarting the man called Castanet. You know, the famous YouTube Twitch streamer from the US. Definitely was in Jamaica for the carnival, boy. And Pretty Dan never go easy on the man and now nah, tell no lie also we have a big man that came out and said that he feels that sir p should run for prime minister for jamaica guys it's crazy we got elephant man also behind the scenes premiered a new video definitely and it's kind of sticky you guys we're definitely going to bring it to you guys so you guys could see the video definitely behind the scenes also another upload today father vlog's daughter with a belt after seeing her twerking for camera in two piece why me i tell you right you now the fathers them not run pumpy especially the caribbean fathers <laughs> also we got the big man the big producer yeah man yeah man kamar mcgregor definitely came out and tell shaggy plain and straight he need to apologize for what he said on the interview about dance and reggae music people who no don't want to miss this yes so say here we go on. i would really appreciate it if you do what give the video a thumbs up smash that subscribe button put your post notification bell on and do leave a comment you know the vibe is already let's kick it off quick and fast yo ff vibes tv i real tv your review boss bring the review them fast want to make sure to hit that subscribe button and a nothing Hit that notification bell. You know it well. FA Vibes TV. We bring that exclusive international and local entertainment review. Well, FA Vibes TV gang, like I told you guys, you see the thumbnail, the title, you know where we're heading with this one. Definitely, we're going to kick it off with the man Carl Kamar McGregor. Mm -hmm. Let's get this out of the way. Now, you guys can remember when Shaggy definitely did that interview and even um, the man um, Kamar McGregor, he have it on his instagram page whereby shaggy said this the dance hall is in an, a incredibly great space right now i think we'd started the year with a bang um i think last year was an amazing year for dance hall because we had drift which i was happy to be a part of so i think that dance hall is slowly moving it but it's a new sound one thing we got to understand the old sound of dance hall that we know the old style of dance hall we know that was very successful by Marty. It did its thing. The highest point in dance hall was that sound. It's over. That sound is no more. I don't think people are gonna make records like that anymore. I think there's a new sound of dance hall that you're hearing, that this kind of trap type sound that they're making, and they're gonna find a way to make it become successful to where it starts to chart and start to do well. It's a new, it's a new day. Well, as you guys just now heard what Shaggy said, now appearing, um, hearing um, Mr. McGregor, yes, Kamar McGregor, we, what he said, because I heard the video, and I'm saying to myself, after listening to Shaggy, Shaggy had some, you know, valuable points with what he's saying about the music. Now, he's not saying like it's dead or it, it doesn't make sense or none of that. This does that. It have a different tone to it, a different song to it. You understand? It gives off a different scene than the rhythms back in other days. He's not lying. You don't get them rhythm they like the bug no more. You don't get them rhythm they like like um the Wally rhythm. You can remember them rhythm the buzz. Chaja God, them bad rhythm there. Masterpiece and them rhythm there. Oh, no, oh, no. Never me a selector them. You know me a talk but you understand? You don't get them rhythm there. Even the man Kamar McGregor, I saw he uploaded something on his Instagram whereby he's um, bringing back the bug rhythm and I think he's calling it the busy or something like that. Upon hearing that, I didn't even like how it sound. Because it doesn't sound nothing like the bug. You know what I mean? Straight. It's like the, the materials that you're getting now to make the rhythms, they're, they're not concrete they're not foundation like the like like like, like the things them or should we say you know I mean, the instrument that you used to use to build rhythm back in those times you understand it's not like that 
they have a different flavor to these new programs that they have that you use to build your rhythm and do your recordings and so forth it's not like back in the days you're not getting that but this is what kamar mcgregor had to say about what shaggy said take a listen people what's up hey so you're welcome all right so I'm doing, I'm doing this live, right? I'm doing this live for Shaggy, because I did post um, an interview that Shaggy, Shaggy did, right? I posted it on my page, because <clears throat> I honestly think, um, that comment or the interview Shaggy did where he make a comment that Reggae and dance and music dead. So Shaggy said authentic Reggae and dance and music dead. Um I honestly think Shaggy, Shaggy need to apologize to Jamaica people and apologize to the entire reggae industry, right? How can Shaggy make such rubbish and misleading statement to say authentic reggae and dance are dead and the future is trap dance and trap reggae shaggy nonsense you need to retract that claim and apologize Or is, or is it because you're managing TJ or TJ is a part of your, your, your team, you're pushing that TJ agenda because TJ do trap dance all. Why are you making that stupid speech? Because I honestly, I honestly believe that it's because TJ is a part of your, whatever you're doing, you make that stupid um argument because shaggy i know you know better you know for artists you know like you sold gold gold record and diamond um under the umbrella of reggae and dancehall music why would you make such such a statement to say authentic reggae and dancehall dead <laughs> But recently, you produced an album with Spice. And the album that you produced with Spice was authentic reggae and dance ah. That means, Shaggy, you don't like Spice. If you were saying in your interview that authentic reggae and dance are music dead, why did you produce an authentic dance album with Spice? So, Shaggy, are you setting up Spice? Or you did set up Spice to fail why she didn't win the Grammy? Because if you're saying that trap dance and trap reggae is a future and authentic reggae is dead, why did you produce an authentic hardcore dance album with Spice? Well, as you guys just know her, you understand? That's just a piece of it and the main, and the main fact of it. We're, we're not going to play the whole video, you know what I mean? You guys could head over to his page, definitely, and check out the whole video. But um, as you guys basically hear what he was saying, you understand? Definitely. But I want you guys to leave your comments below. Let me know what you think about what Mr. Kamar McGregor said. That Shaggy needs to apologize. 
for what he said. Now, you guys heard I played the Shaggy and you heard Mr. Kamar. So leave your comments below. Let me know what you think in the comment section. You understand? Moving on, another upload, another update today. Definitely, we see whereby this big man come out and the man say, yo, Sir P should run for Prime Minister in Jamaica. Now, people, take a listen and we get back with you. You understand? Take a listen. Jamaican people, we've been living with high crime rate for decades upon decades. And we see solutions like SOE, State of Emergency, that has not been effective in lowering crime. In my opinion, what we need is leadership with vision and integrity and also B-A-L-L-S balls to reform and transform the entire system. In my humble opinion, only one leader comes to mind. And that is Sir P from Politics Watch. People, I believe if we, the 70 plus percent of voters who did not partake in the local election, decide to support such a leader, I know Jamaica can be a beacon of hope that everyone can enjoy. So people, in my humble opinion and observation, I believe Sir P from Politics Watch should be the next leader of Jamaica. And Sir P, if you're out there and listening to me, I know I don't really have much impact or sway, but it's something for you to think about. I believe you can start a new political party and the rest of Jamaicans, especially the bloggers, can push this new party and make you become the next prime minister of our beautiful island. Well, as you guys just heard it, I don't have to play out nothing more. What do you guys think about this big man idea of Sir P being Prime Minister for Jamaica? Now, Sir P has been hiding his identity, um, his identity for a very long time. You understand? A lot of us don't know. A lot of persons are saying this big man here could be Sir P. You understand? We don't know. No, we live in a modern age whereby as third world country people, because I'm from a third world country, you understand? And living in a third world country is not everybody's be hip or equipped to how life is now. Now, the could be Sir P. Because remember, you could use things to change your voice, to make your voice sound like how it's sung. It could be. You don't know. Now, second, Sir P running for Prime Minister. Do you guys uh, actually feel like if that go through, the crime rate is going to definitely go down for Jamaica? Leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. You understand with what this man said. Anyway, moving on in the ball game. In the cash today, definitely we got who? Pretty done. Now, guys, if you don't know, go and do your research. Cassinet is a very well-known, you understand, public figure in the streaming world. And who don't know, do on research, guys. Him travel all about the world. And everywhere he go, people always gravitate him because a lot of persons know this guy. This guy's have this guy have millions of followers, subscribers, and all these shit that dog big. So obviously Cassinet was in Jamaica for the Jamaica Carnival, him and some friends. Definitely, and you know how it go, everybody gravitate to the youth. God, the youth does have an energy. You guys see the youth um even give Pablo YG a strength with his music, with his with, with his um freestyle when he drop richer and rich. You understand? So the dude definitely is in Breeze, Jamaica. You understand the man like Jamaican people. Now, this is what Pretty Dan came out and said about casting it people now you guys take a listen and let me know what you think jamaica one thing me have to tell you now. you see how no over there go on over kai nobody boy and go on over kai like that you hear me i tell you no you see who no don't a jamaica feel like i say no see one nowadays michael jackson come down the tuna bro that is not the case this lemon play a video game 
and in getting local gift them and getting streaming rare off of youtube like everybody else me generally you understand me i deal with the way oh the whole on the dung they have they have like a clock michael jackson this every scroll me scroll from my clock time you know what people like jamaica don't know who the that be but because on the dung they are run up and down and i swell them now on the mouth so who don't make Jamaica feel like I said in your man you won one baseball team in America or you won one NBA team or this your man you spectacular you know how much people in America pass guy for the blood clot street people in America don't behave like that over Kai Jamaica who don't alone and give Kai that the blood feel in the way in blood clot of right you know who don't make you not too frightened over every blood Clot body and then from Russia and him start to come down there and I bring two little people from foreign who the same thing said them are kind of people they are some kind of billionaire them are some kind of clad engineer who don't be tapping well you guys heard pretty than clear and plain you understand now I'm gonna break this down to you guys if you guys don't know pretty than you have to know this you see that how casting it you understand can him get him little um gift and this mm -mm. number one and you saw it all like like every other youtube streamer no no do your research the man think that dangerous more than you more than any one of the big vloggers them in a jamaica even you understand no disrespect you understand millions of followers and subscribers this man have you understand people from all around the world be everybody from the biggest to the smallest is give Cassinet his respect because of what he do as a black man he's been labeled as the one of the black man them with the most stream the most views the most subscribers followers them have white boys big like him and them man they say now nah, I forgive him him, 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 him flowers and body him big as a black man I forgive him that respect so I don't feel like it's nothing like that pretty than it's just that the people him does gravitate him because he's a, he's a very joyful youth you know what I mean he's not a boring youth he's not anti-social none of these things so that's the whole thing anyway Kai go the vibe is just like this if you do any research on Kai and look at any one of his videos anywhere he goes man the vibe is up and Jamaica is done a vibe place you see me anyway <laughs> come to the ball game come to the cash we see where you buy elephant man definitely like I said I saw it on pink wall and look like elephant man is doing a video shoot this is um behind the scenes now you guys take a look and listen while well, go on Look for an elephant man before the girl around the road. Man. But remember now, I'm not going to say it loud, so I'm not going to do it two times. So remember one hour, I'm not going to say it. Wake him up now, wake him up now. And, and then, I'm not going to say it. Look for an elephant man before the girl around the road. You know? One thing I rate it, so. Roger, did you think I'm going to make sure that? Yo, sorry, yo, you know where they've got the suburb? Boy, I tell you, yo, without a lie, I like how Elephant Man definitely um, perfecting the youths, them training them how to deal with it behind the scenes, you understand? Look for an Elephant Man, the girl around the car, and I'm mad him. Boy, I tell you, this one looks sticky, I'm like the, um, the story. Big up to Elephant Man, I'm on that day night game long, you understand? Big bad DJ, you understand? Flowers upon flowers, because you don't know them man put in the works. And for know them song they were the man they are dropped is um is it is situations that going on right now is is life is reality you understand car them have man running mad half a woman right now woman around make man run mad be you understand but me them something and i and i mean it them something they can't to me i 
Tom in a run mother over no blood clad girl. <laughs> anyway, go to the bar again, go to the cash before we get out of here. People, we see we're by mm-hmm, Father Vlog's daughter we built. After seeing her twerking for Cameron to peace. Now people, this is very serious, you understand? And you don't know the thing go already with and how the thing go with Caribbean people. Caribbean people don't play them game. You understand? Oh, I'm even scared to show the video. I'm gonna try to see what I go on. You don't know what I go on. You understand? You don't want to get, you understand? You know, you know YouTube go already. It's not too disturbing, but you don't know it go. But like I said, the Caribbean people is very different when it comes to their kids and doing things like this. Now, she was definitely on the video twerking, and you guys could take a look. Let's see what's up. Well, as you guys could see, we're not playing with the whole thing. <laughs> Yo, our father never deal with our easy, bro. If you guys want to see the whole video, you could head over to my Instagram page. That's FF Vibes TV on Instagram. You gonna, yeah, all we can show right out over here. So we just upload it on the Instagram page. So be a part of our Instagram page. Do follow us on Instagram, follow us on Facebook and Twitter. You understand? But like I said, some fathers don't play. The man said, yo, you can't be doing them something there. You understand? I got discredit my credibility. You understand? My credibility updated. People see you as my daughter doing them something the way I feel like. But you know, you think it look like a big girl. She don't look like a child. So I don't know why he's doing this, even though it's his daughter. You know what I mean? She's a big girl. You understand? I mean, I feel she do nothing wrong. As some more ladies like to do all the time work and, and do them something it's not like if she was you know what i mean in, in no kind of sexual activities doing anything freaky or anything on the camera she's doing normal thing what woman is do female does it's like wind them body and do them something there's nothing around you understand but you guys leave your comments below let me know what you think you understand anyway this is where i gotta pull the curtains down it was a pleasure being here with you guys like i said if you watch the content so far once again Please give the video a thumbs up, smash that subscribe button if you haven't as yet, put your post notification bell on, and do share the live, you understand? Anyway, like I told you already guys, follow us on all the social media platforms that you're seeing, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, you know you already, say it go wrong here, so, so big up everybody, that definitely log in. Please follow us on all the social media platforms that you're seeing on the screen right now, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, you understand? And if you haven't as yet, smash that subscribe button. Anyway, the review boss will bring the review fast.